Uh, to me, one particular fighter that stands out is actually on the women's flyweight side, and I'm talking about Chelsea Hackett. Now, Chelsea Hackett, she was, uh, she's a New Zealand-born kickboxer. The last time that she was seen, on, it was in November on Dana White's Contender Series when she lost to a fighter by the name of Victoria Leonardo. And, of course, Victoria Leonardo, she went on to get that contract. And, of course, having lost the fight, Chelsea Hackett goes home. Now, on that particular episode of that show, one thing that Dana White said about Chelsea Hackett was that she said he said that she was one-dimensional. And there are a lot of people that dispute whether or not that's actually true about Chelsea Hackett, but in that particular fight, I would say that she certainly was. And personally, I think that Chelsea Hackett, in particular, is one fighter who could stand to sit down and actually look at that Alistair Overeem blueprint on how to respond to a defeat to sit down and look at it and figure out exactly how she's going to go about using this defeat to make her a better fighter. How far is she willing to go to become a better fighter? I mean, would she go as far as to go train with Victoria Leonardo and to use that experience to help her fill in the missing parts of her MMA? I mean, would she go as far as to go train with Victoria Leonardo and use that experience to help her fill in some of the missing parts of her MMA game? Well, that's a question that she would have to ask herself. And, you know, looking at a role model like, uh, like Alistair Overeem, you could certainly do worse for a role model than that. And while I did agree with Dana White that Chelsea Hackett looked fairly one-dimensional in that fight against Victoria Leonardo, I do hope that, uh, I, I do think that she's a very promising young prospect, and she's still very young. You know, she's not by any means anywhere near to even being in her prime as an MMA fighter, let alone on the verge of being done. I mean, make no mistake about this, you will hear about Chelsea Hackett again, and when you do, I'd like you to remember that you might have first heard about her here. And if, when you're hearing about her again, you hear her talk about how Alistair Overeem was such a valuable example to her in coming back from what was, so far, the biggest defeat of her career, I'd like you to remember that you heard that here first.